Hi, my name is Melanie Lang and I am the director of CBASE, which is an entrepreneurship center at the University of Guelph. For 10 years now, I have been involved with the interdisciplinary product development course, whereby we have food science, business and nutrition students who work together to create new food products and accompanying business plans for industry clients. What that means essentially is that it gives an opportunity for the clients to engage with a soon to be graduating cohort of, of students. Um, they get an opportunity to share some business challenges with the students, um, approach some innovative new food ingredients and processes to new uh, food product development, and the students get a hands-on learning opportunity and an opportunity to engage with businesses from our local community. In product development, we start out doing a little bit of brainstorming, coming up with some unique ideas. After that, we do some market research to see if our idea is appropriate for the target market. And from that point on, you will be mixing and processing your product as you would be on a commercial scale. So you could make these benchtop samples. And from there, uh, you would do some consumer sensory on your, uh, your benchtop samples. So you can send out advertisements throughout the uh, university for people to come and taste your product. And based on the results of their liking of your product, you can kind of make adjustments and reformulate. And that is what we're seeing here today. For instance, if you're taking the tomato, uh, you would turn that into a ketchup or a sauce. So it's everything from the start there, from farm to fork, we say. So there's everything, the microbiology of it, the safety of it, as well there's all the processing aspects, so all the machines and uh, tools you're going to use to process an agricultural product into a finished product as well. I'm Francis and I'm uh, the co-founder of Yoso. Um, I'm a graduate from University of Guelph and I graduated in 1998. We had our idea and we thought it would be a good choice for health conscious consumer. Uh, it was not a really good prototype what we came up with um, but we perfected it uh, afterwards and we started our own business in 2001. Right now we're a manufacturer. We're a small family business specialized in manufacturing and developing um, dairy-free culture products. We're also branching out into coconut products, uh, almond and cashew products. Uh, we're actually one of the leading brands uh, right now in the country. I think I realized what, what I've learned um, years after I graduated from university. It had benefited me a lot uh, because a lot of the principles concepts um, that I've learned from university are still um, the things I do every day.